It's fair to say that tension levels have been heightened as we get ready for this semi-final here at the 2022 World Cup. My name is Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And a special atmosphere for this very special contest. It's Morocco versus France. Well, this could be an absolute classic, and the prize couldn't be any bigger, could it? A place in the World Cup final. Let's just hope we get two teams that want to play good football and come out and attack the opposition. This should be a good game. And here's how Morocco will line up. Yassin Bounou is the goalkeeper. Hakim Ziyech plays with Sufyan Boufal in the wide positions. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Rafael Varane plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. Kylian Mbappe plays with Usman Dembele in the wide positions. And the starting role in attack is handed to Olivier Giroud. And they kick off here. Roma Saiz. Sofian Bufal. Amala. Bufal. An effective ball. Excellent defending. Mbappe. And given away. Well, you get the feeling so many in attendance here have come just to see this man, Kylian Mbappe. Well, Derek, a brace last time out, but no real surprise that we're focusing on him. It's his movement for me, always active, always trying to find that yard of space, and I expect we'll see the same again today. Teo Hernandez. Aurelien Chouameni. Giroud. Offside, close one. Hakimi. Now options are plenty. Well, when all was said and done, Stuart, he wasn't a million miles away. No, he wasn't, because he generates so much power from that sort of distance. His technique is brilliant. Rabiot. Kylian Mbappe. France looking dangerous here, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Amala. Aurelia Chouameni. Kylian Mbappe. Mbappe. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross.
and Naziri. Bufal. Chance to cross. Tremendous block. Another block. And he takes it away. Over the touchline for what will be a France throw. Rabio and Upamecano. Mbappe. Well, as you can see, it's been really tight, and neither side has taken enough risk going forward. Hopefully, that will change soon, and then we might get some entertainment. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. That is that for the first half here. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Griezmann. Here's Mbappe. Is this the moment? And the goalkeeper expertly anticipated that through ball. And Nesiri. Now with Akimi. Ziesh. On to Hakimi. And still dangerous. And there! Well, here's the replay, and you can see why the manager is furious. It's just really poor play, offering up possession far too easily in a dangerous area. And at this level, if you keep doing that, you're going to get punished. It's just not good enough. Restarted, 1-0 here. Giroud. Aurelien Chouameni. Now Rabio. Rafael Varane. Olivier Giroud. Rabio. Chouameni. Promising move this from France. Threading it forward, had to come up with the ball, and did. Rabio, Rabio, flinging himself at it, the keeper. And they're making a change. It's going to be a double substitution. Keen to take it short here. Can they hit on the break? All hands on deck. That's a useful cross. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Hakimi. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Hakimi. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Options in the middle. An alert piece of defending. Just ten minutes remaining here.
Can they fashion something? They need a goal. A very effective challenge put in. Mbappe? Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Time for a change then. Abdelhamid Sabiri. Oh, he's really opened them up here. And it's in! A two-goal cushion! And just look at these fans! They now believe that a trip to the final is theirs. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Goal. 2-0 now, and back on the way. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. And there goes the whistle! Music to the ears of all their fans! They've only gone and made it through to the World Cup Final! Well, that was an excellent display. The result was never in doubt in my view. They controlled the tempo of the game, they looked threatening when they went forward, and they had the better individuals they'll certainly fancy their chances in the final. This performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player.